In Greece, huge wildfires raged for the sixth day, destroying entire towns and forcing thousands of people from their homes. The fires are burning uncontrollably amid a record heat wave. WGN Sean Lewis has more. The skies above the Greek island of Evia glow in eerie red as wildfires burn on the nation's second largest island. Throughout the day and night, boats, both public and private, are on standby to evacuate Evia's nearly 200,000 residents. Thousands of hectares, I think, have been burned by now in Evia and Peloponnesos. People have been moved away from their villages. Dozens of villages have been emptied out uh, for security reasons. In Evia, they've been, the fire has been pushing out the villages into boats. So we see the faces of, of people being moved out of their homes. Government officials worried not only for the island, but for the nation's capital city. Video from the National Forest north of Athens shows the charred remains of trees and buildings. <laughs> this business owner saying the fire department put out the fire at 8 o'clock, but then suddenly at 10, it reignited. He says, we don't know how, and the two factories next to my building were burned. Meanwhile, fire crews from Germany are heading to help with the effort to contain the flames. The European Union asking Germany for the aid as fires in many cases overwhelm those already on the ground, not only in Greece, but in others burning in Italy, Turkey and the Balkans. You really have to have people that know what they're doing when you get really close to these enormous fires. Uh, but they've, now they've kind of, I think most of the volunteers are in the backups and are helping the people that have been dislocated. Efforts to save the woodlands around Athens particularly are important, she says, calling them the lungs of the city. Our most important shield is our forests and losing forests for us is devastating and will have a, a great impact in our ability to to adapt and to shield ourselves from climate change. Sean Lewis, WGN News.